Hey guys, um, Andrew here coming at you from a, a remote location and the topic of this video is what do I do, okay, it's a new year, new year, new me, what do I do to start getting into programming? There are, okay, so first of all, I'm just a dude, okay, my opinion doesn't matter that much, there's a lot of different perspectives, but this is just in my advice, there are two major streams we could take. And the two streams are stream number one, I'm gonna learn the fundamentals. Stream number two, just get into it and do as much as quickly as possible. Now, ultimately you're gonna be doing both. You're gonna be coding as much as possible and you're also gonna understand the fundamentals, but you have to start somewhere. You have to start somewhere. So, if you want to understand the fundamentals, then you wanna know, you wanna know C. What is C? Well, C stands for computer, because in order to understand C, you pretty much need a degree in computer science. In the, it turns out that's what you'll get. So understand C and understand linear algebra, and that takes time. That takes time, but um, don't jump into really big projects just yet. Just do a little bit here, a little bit there, and then gradually, once you understand the concepts, you'll apply them. Now, getting into it as soon as possible, just do Python. Just do Python. Who cares? Oh, oh, the performance of Python, if you look here, it's what, it's compiled, it's interpreted, just do Python, okay? Dude, you don't, you, this is your first time programming, just do Python. Okay, so Python and Pygame is a really great way to get started. There's actually, when I, when I, thawed myself off and, and got out of the uh, the ice of um, not programming. That's actually how I started again, as I got into Python and Pygame. Actually, no, I got into Turtle. That's it, just hustle. I believe in you. Ultimately, the goal is to make as many things as possible and don't make complete things. Look at a game, break it down into little subsystems and make prototypes of the subsystems. Then keep going, keep going. The first time you make it, it's hard. The second time you make it, it's a little bit easier, and so on. And um, and there it is, just keep down that track. Give it a year, see how you feel. Make some progress. All right, so for what it's worth, those are just little, little bits of advice. I believe in you, you can do it. Come on, get into game development.